The Year with Grandma Moses. And there she is at her painting table in 1952. When Grandma Moses looks out her window, she sees a world of spotted cows and rolling hills and white picket fences. A world of thunderstorms, rain-drenched fields, and hand-washed laundry flapping in the wind. Where hired hands plow open fields and children play in flowering orchards. Where friends and family gather on moving day to help a needy neighbor. Or congregate in hay-filled fields to celebrate nature's fullness. There's always plenty to do. There's corn to pick, grain to thresh, and pumpkins to snip from the vine. just in time for Halloween. And the first snowfall when we'll give thanks for all we have. With Christmas around the corner, we'll have lots of fun outdoors. And indoors too opening presents, playing games, and feasting on food we've helped to prepare. But we won't stay inside for long. When the pond freezes over, we'll go skating until our toes tingle with cold. Once they thaw, we'll go out again to help at sugaring time. But it won't stay cold forever. Winter snows will melt, icy ponds will thaw, and horses will run wild as spring comes round again. The end.